Fuck Hi. yeah. Welcome oh. to Australia, everyone. This is Alex and Alexa. You guys know them. Boy, boy. I did a thing. We're in Australia. And uh, we're going to be exploring different animals. Yeah, so we have, um, we're in the, what is this place called? Australian Reptile Park. Reptile Park. Reptile Park. Yeah, so we're going to be seeing a bunch of reptiles and um, seeing how it goes. We're taking you behind the scenes. Yeah, we have behind the scenes, and which is going to be, what, koalas? And uh, milking a snake. I think it's milking a snake is the main thing. Is that it? It's milking a snake. I think we get something about spiders. We have to touch yeah. a lot of things. I'm excited. Oh, oh my god, look at the size of that. <laughs> Deadly and dangerous species. Oh, they have a rating of how dangerous they are. Look at that. It looks fake. It looks like a rock. If we asked them, they'd rate us. I was like, what's our, what's our danger rating <laughs> between the three of us? You'd get a 10. Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> his, <laughs> his, his YouTube videos. Thank you, Carter, for the call. <laughs> no. I think it doesn't care what, what it wants us to do. Like, we, like, do something. <laughs> Be entertaining. Oh, yeah, <laughs> it can live in two hot, in excess of 200 years old. Oh, wow. So I was like, Connor's the short king. Yeah, I'm the shortest here. What are you talking about? What do you guys mean? I'm not the shortest, guys. So, wait, the kangaroos are just out? Yeah, they're just what? all around this area. Can you go up to them? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that not dangerous? Um, the pretty chill. You just gotta pick the right kangaroo. They look like they are just vibing. I don't think they give a f that you're here. <laughs> give them a little bit of that. Hey. What is that? Just, I wouldn't eat that either. <laughs> like, they don't give a no, huh? Come on, it's good. Look. Oh. Oh. Why is it moving so slowly? Yeah, over there. Oh. Oh. No, I missed it. I missed it. Do it again. Was... Alrighty. Um, my name is Katya. What did I meet you? Behind the scenes this afternoon. Um, yeah. Let's get so, like, what do we do on this, like, this uh, behind the scenes? Um, so a little bit of everything. Um, okay, cool. Like, we meet a whole bunch of different animals, um, a few mammals, a few reptiles. Uh, we'll do a snake milking for you. Oh. Um, that Can kind of stuff. Can we drink so... the milk? Is that possible? No. <laughs> it, is, it is not milk. It is better. Um, and theoretically, you can drink it, however. <laughs> However, Don't give him ideas. Don't give him ideas. Brushed your teeth too hard this morning, it will kill you. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> so this absolutely gorgeous giant here is Hugo. Um, so Hugo is a 71-year-old giant Galapagos tortoise. Oh my god. Um, so these guys are the largest species of tortoise on Earth. Um, Hugo here is a spring chicken as far as Galapagos tortoises go. At 71 years old, he is about prime breed. Oh my god. Which is about the equivalent of a 25 or 30-year-old human. Wow. Um, so this fast. species should yeah, live up to about 200 yeah, years, fine. and their lifespan's only getting longer and longer the longer we have them in captivity and the better we get at caring for them. Oh my god. So, you guys will have the opportunity to absolutely meet Hugo today. If you would like, you are more than welcome to come on over and give him a new hat. The only thing I ask is that you don't touch him on the head or the front legs, um, but anywhere along his shell and on his back legs is fine. Wow. I've never seen him. So, if you don't want anyone. Is getting crushed. And if he does love the attention, he'll spend all the time wandering up and down the front here when people are there, sort of just taking a look at everyone. It's very happy. Feels like a tortoise. Does it? Yeah. I have no idea what a Yeah, I mean, that's kind of what I expected that to feel like. Surprisingly soft, right? <laughs> oh, his, his feet? Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's a bit like that. <laughs> oh, oh, whoa. Um, unfortunately, these guys are endangered, though. Um, so over on the Galapagos Islands, uh, basically human interference has caused a huge decline in their numbers. Um, and there's a few reasons behind it. The first was when they first discovered them, um, they slowly discovered that these guys can live months without food or water. Um, oh, wow. So they were like, hey, great idea, let's just stick him in the hull of the ships and instead of using cattle and sheep that have to poop and eat all the time, um, we'll just eat these guys instead on our nice long voyages. I heard they taste delicious. Um, and Oh, they brought over herds of goats. Oh, so it must be so confused. <laughs> How long does it take to get to this big? Sorry. Sorry? How long does it take for them to grow this big? Um, so to reach this sort of size, yeah. you're looking at about 40 years. Oh my god. Um, 40 or 50. Wow. Yeah. And then they, yeah. then they stop growing then? And then they they don't completely stop, they'll still slowly grow. So Hugo is expected to reach about 250 kilos in his yeah. lifetime. Oh, um, so he's still got a little ways to go. He won't get much bigger, but he'll long out. Right. Yeah. Perfect. If you guys would like to see her, we can go have a look. I love dogs. Bye. She's only 17.
uh, bored inside the shell with running around. Shell. Um, so Galapagos tortoises. It's so strange. Oh wow! Yeah. Wow. <laughs> they really. Felt I guess they don't have any adult-sized ones because I guess they're dangerous. Yeah, the red kangaroos. They're like they're pretty violent. I mean, they still they still get be very like calm. Here. Yeah. 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 Okay, I don't know. Just only see videos of people no punching them. Yeah. Is that what you want to do? No, no, what? no, no. Fight a kangaroo. No. Why do I want to do that? That's, no, I'm <laughs> kidding. I, he said that, not me. <laughs> is, that, that, is that the next evolution of YouTuber boxing? It is. <laughs> <laughs> it's too boring fighting other YouTubers. We need to fight. We need to fight animals. Hey, uh, have you seen any uh, koalas around here? No, I haven't. Yeah, I I think oh, you can go thing. inside oh, yeah. the koala. Always want to go inside a koala. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you said it. Oh, oh, oh yeah, okay. This is the koala this loves is you. Oh my god, they're just chilling. I've always thought they were really cute, but apparently, then they have chlamydia. They got chlamydia and they got really sharp claws. Oh god. I had it once where I um, had one fall on me. Okay. Um, and they just dig into you. Like, oh, was, how did it yeah. fall on you? It was a baby that fell out of a tree. Onto you. And then I was the closest thing, so it kind of grabbed onto me. Oh. <gasps> is there a lot of them in Australia? Or are they kind they of. They used to be. They used to buy the oh, Carl the Good A lot of deforestation. But oh. if you go up north, you'll see them. So this absolutely gorgeous little munchkin here is Louie. Ooh, that's adorable. <laughs> and Louie is a 10-month-old koala joey. Um, now, unfortunately, in New South Wales, it is illegal for anyone who is not a trained zookeeper to hold a koala. I know. <laughs> I know. It is sad. I so am sad. sorry. Yeah. Um, as a reptile keeper, I'm very lucky that even I'm trained on this because <laughs> not even everyone at this facility is allowed to hold them. So... <laughs> But you guys are absolutely allowed to have a really good little pat. Um, I'll try and pop him up on this branch here and see if he sits for me. And you can have a little cuddle as well. Um, we just can't pick him up. That's fine. All righty. My only rules today are that you don't touch him on his head or his face, but yeah. anywhere down his back is totally fine. And cool. is, is that rule for a reason? Is that because the koalas can be aggressive sometimes? So or? it's not because of aggression. Um, the reason you're actually not allowed to hold them is more for their welfare. Yeah. Um, so koalas have what's called a floating rib cage. Um, so they don't have a sternum. They just have loose floating lip, ribs in their oh, wow. torso. Wow. So it's great for them when they're sitting up in the trees, hunched over 20 hours a day sleeping. It's nice and comfortable for them. Um, but once upon a time when patrons were holding them, um, people were picking them up around the, the waist oh. of the human baby. Um, and they were... Them. Oh my god. It's horrifying. Could you imagine you want to pick up a koala and you accidentally kill them? So they're very picky about what they like to do. waterproof. Yes, so their coat is completely oh. waterproof. It's a triple layered. Oh um, so it needs to be waterproof. It also needs to be fully insulated, um, obviously, yeah. with the Australian yeah. weather. These so guys nice. want to be. <laughs> what, is it, what is it feel? I don't know. How do you describe the feeling of this? It's uh, a bit yeah. like really fine wool or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's like someone made a really bad Brillo pad. It's like the shape of the stuff that you use to like wash dishes, but made out of really soft. <laughs> it's so cute. Bless it. Oh, it's so adorable. Um, so they are not very intelligent animals. I don't know if you guys know much about the way the brain works but essentially the more wrinkles you have in your brain the more intelligent you are oh, they have completely smooth brains. Oh, I wish I had a smooth brain yeah that would be nice oh my god so you can hi you want to say hi it's like doesn't care I guess it's not really much of a problem yeah it's not really much of a problem yeah it's not really much of a problem I guess there's not really many predators for them either like naturally what besides foxes and cats and you know and so those. koalas get away with being so dumb um, because they don't have any natural Because they're so damn cute. Um, <laughs> they actually don't serve any ecological niche at all. Um, <laughs> they so don't they, do anything. They don't do anything. They Nothing. don't provide any nutrients to the environment via their fecal matter. They don't keep eucalyptus numbers down. They don't provide any major food source for any other animal. Um, they just literally good. just exist to sit in the trees and look cute. I like oh, that's animal. great. Yeah. 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 Um, all of the branches that you guys can see in each of the enclosures have to be changed every single day. What? Um, because they only eat what's called the tip of the leaf. Um, so they don't eat <laughs> don't the entire laugh? branch. They They're only so eat useless. the little branch. <laughs> Because um, those are the highest in nutrients, and those have the highest water content. Everything no. else is kind of. Why are they so picky? They don't do anything. Yeah. I think it's one of those animals that want so to die. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they want, like, if they weren't cute, would we? Would we have helped? We wouldn't. You know, like keep them around. If they look like 
like a salamander, nobody would have done it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad to hear you did. Yeah. I love how this one over there is like posing like it's for an album. It's yeah, like, yeah, very oh, pensive. Suffering with success over there. They're just, so they just dumb by the way they look away. I'm like, usually animals, they really walk with a purpose, so they hear the words and they're like this. He just goes, Sorry. <laughs> ready, boys? Ready? Yeah. Come on. Face the other way. Face Come on. What's over here? Yeah, go, go, go. <laughs> Are you so dramatic? <laughs> you saying, what are you going, buddy? <laughs> He's like, no, fuck this. So dramatic. Thank you, sir. Um, so baby koalas don't have the ability to digest eucalypt. It's still toxic to them. Um, so they eat the mum's fecal matter. Um, oh, and that's a process called pathing. But it's, a, it's coated in like a special oil, basically. Um, so it has to be from a lactating female. Um, so yeah, if we're hand raising a koala, we have to go out and collect that from another female to give to the baby that we're hand rearing. Australia. They really made it really complicated to survive. This is Australia. <laughs> <journal. laughs> they really tried their hardest not to live. Does the koala have a bit of a smell to it? Yes, yeah, absolutely. I can smell that. It's like, can I smell it? Yeah, yeah, go for or it. That is your hand. No, 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 Is that eucalypti? Is that? Yeah, so yeah, it is kind nice. of eucalypti oh, when the they're little. It's yeah. actually not too bad. The males have definitely a stronger so smell cute. than the females. It just doesn't care about anything, does it? No. Such chills. narrow eyes. As well. So, do they do anything for fun? Are they, <laughs> they got any hobbies? <laughs> they literally sleep, sleep, eat, and mate. Do they have That's a Twitch it. channel? Is that what you're <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's good. Thank you. Thank you. So, cassowaries are considered to be the deadliest bird in the world. They have been responsible for a total of three human deaths. Oh, yeah, absolutely insane. Oh it's more than any other bird That's on the face it. of the planet. Now, you guys are more than welcome to come over this side of the fence. We are going to yeah. just down here. The only thing I'll ask is that you try to keep at least some arms distance away from the fence. Okay. Um, Scary. Oh, let's have a look. All right, here we go. Wow, look at that. Oh. Oh, he wants to fight. He does. Can you see, he looks intelligent, though. The way yeah. He looks intelligent. Not like the f***ing smooth leg. Like, oh, look at this guy. How many grooves are in this dude? <laughs> it didn't look like it was squaring up. It, it did. Like, it looked like it was about to throw hands. Do you reckon I Do they get lay on lay down? Give it a, give it a mean right hook. <laughs> oh, here we go. Okay. He's, he's, he's. We get to eat a grape as well. We get to feed the cassowary. Whoa. No way. They look pretty astute. Because like, the beak looks like, and the, the little, uh, what is it? I don't know what you call it. The hat. The hat. Uh, hat. All right, let me, let me get this in shot. Let me. All right, go ahead. Come on, mate. Would you like a grape? Oh, good aim. Good aim. <laughs> pretty cute. Really good, yeah. yeah. Here you go. Oh, yeah, he's oh so God. gentle. Then it chucks him back. How beautiful are his eyes? I have one. Yeah. <laughs> oh. No, no, you're hoping it'll go wrong. Yeah, yeah. yeah people, exactly, uh, right? <laughs> oh, that's so crazy. Oh, my God. Um, he just wants the grape. How is it dangerous? Apparently, it's a dangerous bird. It's the most deadly bird. Yeah, it's killed, killed three people. And so much eye contact as well. It yeah. just follows you. Because he's got a grape. It's staring only at the grapes. Yeah. It just yeah. doesn't. Yeah, he's like, he's it could so not give it a, a, a heck that we're here. Oh, oh he's one by one. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Uh oh. Is it going to get out of the water? It's, now, is it going to go in the water? Oh, it is. Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh no, he's trying to get it. Oh no. You're going to drown. Oh, I didn't mean to. It was an accident. <laughs> You're going to kill the I, I didn't mean to. So cassowary eggs are particularly stunning as well, which is why people try to steal them. Um, they're about this big um, and bright Whoa, green. Absolutely wow. stunning. Yeah. Yeah. Eggs are about, yeah, big oh, look, you can see the feathers yes. now. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, there are no more grapes. Oh, yeah, it can tell, yeah, there's, it can like tell there's no grapes. <laughs> What's in here? Uh, should be frogs, right? But there's no frogs. What do you expect them to just be swimming on the surface for you to see? Yeah. There's so many birds. These are everywhere around the suburbs. The you you saw them really? before, just flying around. Yeah, yeah, I did. I saw a lot of the um, what are the yellow headed things? Oh, oh cockatoos. Cockatoos. Yeah, I saw yeah, a bunch yeah. of those. Just chilling. Yeah. Yeah, that's so amazing. If you guys enjoyed everything so far, you guys like the koalas? I enjoyed the koala a lot. It was really cute. It's kind of sad to hear how, how dumb they are. Kind of hope they had a bit more going for them. It kind of seemed like they were just kind of inting. They were running it down mid, but with life. I kind of, I, I, you know, I, I respect it in a certain sense. You know, they don't want to conform to societal needs. Who needs to do stuff? 
I can just exist and be really picky and someone else will take care of the problem for me. Oh my god, there's a bird. That's so cute. It doesn't look like a real bird, it looks like a cartoon bird. Come here. Come here. Come here. No! Yes. No! Come back! So true wildlife here in Australia. Some really some really impressive stuff I've seen so far. Let us go inside. Oh the bird! Oh. That was really cute. I don't think the crocodile has moved a single inch. It's, it's just sitting there. Monkey came to Australia. Who let him in? You guys have monkeys, right? I'm sure there's some monkeys in Australia. There's monkeys everywhere. Australia has no monkeys. No native monkeys. But I'm here now, so the population has gone up a little bit. The crocodile still hasn't moved. When we went in there, I'll describe it to you what it looked like. We went in there and there was like danger. Spiders everywhere. It was like danger and there was a bunch of spider signs. And there's a bunch of cloth covering 500 spiders in the room. Apparently they were alive. So there's 500 spiders just in this tiny little office space, like a Japanese living room size. Tiny, nothing, not even livable. Uh, and there was just so many of them. And they were just telling us about how dangerous they are and how they could kill us. Meanwhile, these birds keep coming near me. They're really goddamn cute. Who made them so cute? Oh, oh well, we're going this way, okay. Yay! Now, not only do we have some of the most toxic snakes on the planet, we also selectively breed them to produce more venom than their wild counterparts. So what that means is you find two most psychotic ones that give a lot of venom, you put them together, you hope for the best and the absolute worst comes out. And what, why do you want the most venom? So, that allows us to keep less snakes and produce more venom. Oh. Uh, coastal taipans in the wild at 6 to 7 foot will produce about 0.9 of a gram of venom. But that's enough to kill 450 people my size. Easy. Current average for this facility is 2.2 grams. Current record by this facility is by Nervous Ned there, and that's 4.9. <laughs> that's 3,000 people my size dead. The reason we do that is we can keep less snakes and produce more uh, venom. Each fortnight, so every two weeks, the snakes are removed from the enclosure, uh, restrained, and then uh, convinced to bite into a jar. Now, as you can see, we only use the most highly scientific pieces of equipment here at the Reptile Park which is an oversized pillow and an oversized potato mat. <laughs> now that allows us to securely and safely for both us and the snakes, uh, restrain the animal and then convince him to bite. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab a snake and I'll show you exactly how we restrain the pad. Okay. So this is a coastal side now. Yeah, this one also has to be the leading uh, record holder until Nervous Ned took that title. Oh, oh my God, it's beautiful. Oh. So it's a fairly big stunning. He is an older one, so he's a bit more relaxed and will be nice and gentle with him. He's been milked before. Yeah, he knows the best. Oh. Uh, it's like bullying. <laughs> <laughs> Have you got bullying? Well. Oh, yeah. So even though he knows the deal. Whoa. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. So. Do they have much strength in them when you're holding yeah, them? Yeah, a fair bit. You wouldn't want to work in your So, finish the target. See you lock on. Ready, steady. There we go. Oh, so you can come in nice and close now, guys. Just don't touch the shot. Shot. That, shot. that is oh so God. much. Okay, so we hear he's venom. It's just a bit of a massage. Just to see if we can get a little bit more out of him. <laughs> wow. I see what he said, milking. Now. Oh my kind God. Oh my God, that's crazy. So that's probably two and a half grams there. And um, that is a lot. You got to think that's yeah, nice. two and a half thousand people. Holy. Or two thousand people. Oh my God. Jeez. I think watching them milk the snake made me more thirsty than not. <laughs> this shit made me thirsty. What does that say about me? I, like, I saw the snake shoot all the liquid in and I'm like, fuck, I'm gonna drink something. When they bite people, do they usually inject the same amount? Are they? Yeah, well, you'll notice most of that was in that first initial way. Yeah. This is the sketchy bit. So he's not dry, he's not safe. You don't think a scratch will kill you. That's about half of what he's got in his head, so he can go again if he wants. Uh, plus it's like saliva. You've been to the dentist, they suck out the spit, 30 seconds later it's back. So he's never safe. Now this is the bad bit. When I get him out of the hook, when I put him back in, it's just too quicker. So I'll get you to jump back in your spots. This is the dodgy bit. Uh, Big three, one, two. Three. Ooh, <laughs> just sucks yeah, it. Oh, yeah, pushing for the best. So. <laughs> oh my god. So if you have a little cut on your hand Do now, and that got in there. Yeah, let's have a shot. Yeah. Now, different snakes get different amounts of venom. Now, this one here. For example, King Browns, that's oh, from about eight snakes. Nice and bright yellow. So different proteins, different color, 
Tiger snakes, substantially less, so that's from about 30 mil. Eastern browns, second most toxic snake on the planet. You're absolutely bugger all. That's from 23 snakes. Wow. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Now, Efficient. Yeah, you, it sucks. <laughs> one free photo with a python, koala, or alligator. Here you oh, go. Oh, oh, we're going for the python. Which one's yeah, the lion for the python? I think it's over there. Should we go here then? Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. You want all your gear in the photo as well? Yeah, can I have it in the photo? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I give you my phone, picture phone? Alrighty. Oh, you got a camera as well. Oh, you got a camera? Oh, it's live. Yeah, we're live streaming. Alright. 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 Come on. Turn it on like this. <laughs> Who gets oh. the snake head? <laughs> oh, I got a. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's so slow. 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 Oh, it's you look like a drug lord with that. <laughs> you look like you start an empire. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, oh, it's so heavy. Through there, so bring that hand out. Okay. Yeah, I'm on top. Okay, I'm on top. Yeah, yeah, like that. That's just gonna sit there. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. You can, it just feels like one giant muscle. Pretty much is. Not this is close. crazy. How would you know if it's about to kill you or try to? You only have a couple of seconds and then everything would go black. <laughs> what? Holy. It's so good if it's dragging you. That'd be such a good clip. That'd be it. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Success. How did you convince it? This one's near us. Yeah, true. It's you think it, maybe they're short sighted? He looks so lazy. Like, he didn't even care at all. Lick my That's hand, young man. Yeah, I'm going to get a selfie with you. Oh, that's a right good idea. That, that'll do great on oh. Twitter. Can I get some as well? Yeah, let me, uh, uh, I'll just hand me the second yeah, helping. The <laughs> this feels sketchy. <laughs> he's he's oh, more he's interested in the tree than you. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Does it look like he's killed me? A little bit. Put it on my head. If get I, eat off my head. I don't think this is safe, but if you really want him to. I do. Oh, that's awesome. But well, you need a bit more. So yeah, you need a little. <laughs> oh, no, no, he doesn't want your hair. You just we lose get, your we hair. We should get a photo of all of us with next to the kangaroo. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, oh that's so nom, cute. Nom, oh, yeah, you want that. God, I just love food too. I, I'd, be, I like I'd, I'd be the exact same if someone came to me with like some walkers. Just someone comes to me at the convention. Here, <laughs> he's a, pulls he's, it on their head. Yeah, yeah, but, <laughs> eat me. We should have like the three of us doing the oh, same the I same thing behind him. Are you, are you going to spoon the kangaroo? Yeah. <laughs> You're going to die. Don't spoon kangaroo. I don't know why he's doing this. <laughs> what are you doing? This is awful. This hey, put your hand on him. Yeah, that's no. Cool. <laughs> What if he kicks you? He can't yeah. kick you from that angle. How does it feel? You see the kangaroo? This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. Australians be like. This poor kangaroo. You get, get one touch. Oh, it's got a little baby. Oh, you got a baby. You're, You're a, a baby. <laughs> what are you doing? Aussies are cursed, right? It's a bit annoying. I love this. Who am I? Like, it's like an existential <laughs> crisis. It's just like. <laughs> uh. It says a quokka. That's not a quokka. What is that? It's an echidna. Is that oh, what they are? Is it, what's the difference? These guys are chill as well. People take selfies with them. And they're smiling. So yeah. luckily, I'm not going to stick my hand in, but I can stick the camera in. Yeah. Hey guys, how you doing? Oh, oh no! Oh, he wants to smell it. That's very cute. What's going on there, buddy? We're live. Come on, put some Pepe hands in the chat. Do an Omega lol. Give me a pog. Give him a oh, pog. this one's waddling over. Waddle's so cute. It's adorable. It looks like when you see them in the wild, often they're on the side of the road. Yeah. It's really frustrating because you don't want them to be on the road, so they're going to get killed. Uh, so I'll try to pick them up. But as soon as you touch them, they do this thing where they kind of, they roll in on themselves and they make this like kind oh. of like, oh, like wow. it's like semi, like a um, half ball and you cannot pick them up. Their spikes are so spiky. It's like it's kissing the other one. Oh, that's oh, cute. How do they have sex? That is a good question. <laughs> that's it's impossible. That's what we all want to know. If Can we I get 10,000 likes, they'll have sex right now. Can I touch it? <laughs> no, no. So, I don't think you can touch now. it. I don't think you're allowed to touch it. You You'll just hurt yourself. Yeah. Alex is a menace, I know, right? You can't be stopped. <laughs> He's gonna keep oh, me. oh, his claws are so sharp! Oh my <laughs> god! Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> f***ing hell! They're just going at it! Oh, I can give him a little scratch on the head. Look at that. So you call me weird for spooning the kangaroo, but you're liking getting whoa, your fingers whoa. licked. This oh, one feels big. This one, this one does, <laughs> this one, this one does not feel, oh, he what just wants food. Feed him. You gotta feed him. Are you drugged or something? What's wrong with you, boy? <laughs> it's kind of like a donkey. That's what yeah, it is. Yeah, you're a donkey kangaroo. Who made you? <laughs> oh!
That's adorable. Its head's poking out. I see why Australians love them. Yes. Oh. Wow, it is like oh, a really historic oh, creature. It's big. Dude, why is it got so slow? Dude, its eyes. Oh, that is awesome. How could you possibly do that? Oh, it's going back down. I don't All right, that boring. All right, that's lame. Oh, let's All go right, eat well. some food. Let's go eat some food. <laughs> yeah, that would be you. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> that's beautiful. I look miserable. You look so nice. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Whoa. Cool. Oh. Man, that one's awesome. Sick. Whoa. We look, actually we, good. We look like we enjoy each other's company. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you believe that? Yeah. I was eating a bread. Good work. What's going yeah, on? I'm all right. Well, I guess, guys, <clears throat> thank you so much for joining. I guess we'll wrap it up there. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Yes. Any, uh, any final closing words? <laughs> Go and check out their channels. Uh, Boy Boy and I did the thing. Yeah, uh, yeah. I should do the YouTuber outro as well. It's going to be a YouTube video. Yeah. Uh, do you have an outro? Well, you don't do an outro. I don't. I just uh, say something.